guys, welcome back to another episode of Corvettes 918. And of course, there's just Corvettes all over the place around here. Um, but I'm not at the uh, normal Tuesday night car show because this is our monthly uh, Corvette meeting. And typically that's gonna uh, be on the first Tuesday of every month. That's what I wanted to do, you know, even though we're not at the car show, I did want to take you around, look at a couple of cars. Uh, really don't have a subject to talk about tonight, but let's just look at some Corvettes.
Well, guys, that was some of the cars that was there. Of course, there was a whole lot more cars than what I was able to get on camera uh, because I had to get into the meeting you know, the, the first Tuesday of every month, of course, we have our uh, Corvette meeting and it's a good time to see all the different things, all the different events that are coming up for that, for that month, but also for the next couple of months ahead of time. And one of the events, which is gonna be, which is probably one of the largest events that we do each and every year is the Eureka Springs Corvette event. And that's gonna be coming up uh, the first weekend of October. I know some of you guys may be attending that. I will be there. It's a Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. It's a four day event. Excited about that. If you guys are gonna be going to that, send me an email, let me know you're gonna be out there. Um, I'm going to be doing, posting some uh, uh, vlogs. I'm gonna vlog that for, a, it's gonna be a daily vlog for four days. So I'm gonna take the laptop, I'm gonna take my camera, and each day that I'm out, you know, checking out what's going on, I'm gonna make a video of that and put it out that evening, uh, or prob yeah, probably that evening, so that you guys can come along. So, so guys, to touch on the last video that I did, the zero to 60 times, a lot of people had asked me questions. You know, Chuck is, you know, the Corvette only go, you know, 3.7 or 3.9 or four, four seconds, I think is what even one of them was. Well, I can tell you this, of course, in that video, all I was trying to stress was how to use launch control. But yeah, th th if you want to get a really good 60 second time, don't use launch control. Just get the tires warm um, and then, you know, get to where you're going to go and floor it. Times, yeah, that car is rated at 2.9, but it's like any of these other things, whether it's the Dodge Demon or it's a Hellcat, you know, these times that they have set up on it. Uh, that they publish out there, that's everything being perfect conditions. We're talking about perfect temperatures. You know, they're, they're probably doing that on a strip where you've got better traction. Um, you know, tires are, you know, probably cut, well, they're probably cut two tires on that Z06. So all those little things are gonna factor. I mean, you can get a half a second uh, to three quarters of a second by having the right variables. Uh, but I don't care if this thing only did four seconds. It's still fast and it's more than fast enough for me. Uh, but just to kind of answer some of the questions you guys might have had uh, on the 60 times. Guys, I want to take just a moment and welcome all the new subscribers or what I like to call Corvette's 918 family members. We've had almost a thousand brand new people come into the channel within the last 10 days or so. So I wanted to take just a moment and welcome each and every one of you guys. You know, when someone hits that subscribe button, to me, it's an honor that you have taken the time, that you're gonna take the time to come along with me as I share my experience with my Corvette Z06 and go out and check out cars and all the, there's no telling what I might be doing. I might be sitting on a Lear jet. I might be, you know, out going 140. in Mexico. You just never know what I'm going to be doing on this channel. And sometimes we're just checking out cars. Um, and I, again, I want to say a huge, huge thank you for coming along. And I hope you guys enjoy the future videos. Before I leave and before we show off some of you guys' amazing rides, I also want to just let everybody know that is in Florida or the East Coast or possibly even into the Gulf, Guys, we're, we're thinking about you, we're praying for you. I know you guys are about to face uh, Irma, which is looks like it's just gonna be a, it's gonna be a damaging event. And guys, uh, I hope that you guys are safe. I hope that your homes are spared. I hope your cars, I hope your businesses, uh, just life as you know it, uh, you don't face a direct hit from that thing. Guys, until I see you at the next video, I hope each and every one of you have a blessed week. And now let's check out some of your rides.
in when your heart's bleeding and all you can see is red till you discover it is within each other to forgive and make amends if i had known then what i know now i wouldn't have said what i said i took the long road thought i'd be better on my own sometimes what's right is wrong instead cause i And I didn't understand that you 